What are we going to do, boys? Set up lines. For what? For turkey hunting. Gobble, 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 gobble. <laughs> You guys are coming with Dad to set up a few blinds for us to hunt in this week? Yep. This week? Yes. Hi guys, we just got out of the truck and we're just getting loaded up and ready. I think we're going down that trail. We're going to set up a turkey blind. Right now we have to figure out where the position is, Tristan. because. If we can, we want to be able to see this meadow out in front of us, okay. as well as some of this back here. So we're going to go down this trail just a little bit and see if there's a position we can put the blind and see multiple locations so that we can see the birds better when we're hunting. Okay. All right. Dad, look what I found. Did you not see these? No, what did you find? Show what? the camera. What'd you find, Tristan? Turkey feathers. Turkey feathers! I thought we should go over there. You want to check that out over there? Yeah. We're going into the blind. Let's look. Got my stakes. Pull that out. Put one stake in each corner. Yeah, this is really soft ground. What are you boys getting ready to do? Turkey, Turkey hunt. hunt. All right, we better go get loaded up in the truck. Usually dad is the first one ready to go, but this time, this boy was. Well, we just got set up in our blind here, me and the boys and cameraman Uncle Steve. We're hearing a few birds, but they seem a long ways away, but we're in a spot that we hope we can cut them off as they're going out to a field behind us about 60 yards to strut and feed in so uh, we'll see what the morning brings Five, ten more minutes. Wow. 
So yesterday morning, we went out to one of the blinds that I had scouted and put up earlier in the week, right? And we put it up. Mm -hmm. And we didn't really hear many birds, nothing around us. Um, they were very quiet yesterday morning. Didn't have any luck, didn't even see a bird. Not even when we got out and drove around. Just pheasants and geese and ducks and deer. <laughs> yesterday evening, I came out to roost birds, see if we could get in a different position. I found some toms saw where they flew up last night at uh, sunset went moved the blind that we were in yesterday morning to this current location which is about 230 yards from where the birds roosted on a neighboring property they flew off the roost really early i don't even think uh, it was legal shooting light they flew off the roost we could tell they were on the ground made a few calls they came in put on a little bit of a show and we were able to harvest a nice tom this morning right tristan yeah the ammo that I was trying out this morning was the Federal Premium 3rd Degree TSS. Um, it worked flawlessly. I think even Steve Ranella would have been proud of the shot that I made uh, and killed that turkey dead. The gun that I was shooting this morning was the Winchester SX3 Longbeard. Um, this year, on top of it, I have a Vortex Crossfire Red Dot, brand new for 2020. Why do I like a red dot on my turkey gun? It just makes the target acquisition and acquiring it pulling trigger seamless easy it's not necessary to have an optic but once you have an optic you're going to wonder why you weren't shooting an optic a long time ago we'll be eating good tonight can you fan that tail out tristan there you go there you go hold it kind of like that and you can just kind of fan them out something that i think is important for all of us is to take somebody else out hunting and for me i've got three young boys tristan's the oldest but now this is the fourth turkey hunt you've been on, right? Yeah, this is how old I am. You're seven. seven. It's fun to take somebody out to see the excitement on their face, right? Look at that excitement. He's happy to be out, even if he had to get up at 4 a.m. Well, we got back to Grandma and Grandpa's. We're gonna get our bird cleaned up. Remember, it's impossible to hit the shots you never take. So pull that trigger and shoot for a dream. See you later, guys. See ya. My dad did. He's the best. But I'm the best hen turkey caller. <laughs> nice. Aren't they pretty? Yeah. It's so fun to see them out in the wild, see the beauty that God has created. Yep. And it's also fun to hunt them. Yes, sir. <laughs> 